Hello everyone, it has been a while uh, since I uh, put a video on uh, YouTube. I've been busy outside and with RV, but it's a rainy day here, I can't do much outside. So I decided to make a funicular railroad. As you can see, it's working. And uh, it's actually funny. I got this idea uh, when I seen it in uh, Portugal last year, when I vis visited my friend there. And I thought, uh, that was actually a Y version. Now I messed around with that on G scale, and that's easier to do. But on HO scale, uh, I have to synchronize the switches. So there will be two Y switches and then one track in the middle. I am uh, experimenting with it, and this is a uh, module, so I can uh, just change it. The other one, the other one is uh, exactly the same wood, exactly the same size, but it has one track in the middle, a Y switch, with a uh, pass uh, lane, and then goes back to one lane onto the top. As you can see, um, it's running pretty good. And I uh, thought I would like to share that uh, with you guys. I posted some uh, pictures on Facebook in my uh, model, rain, model Railroad group. And um, more of the making of it. And this is more the working of it. It's not that difficult. It's all parts from all the uh, electronics. The motor on top uh, is out of a printer. These these followers there for the tread is out of a printer. I had four of them on top too. So it's not uh, rocket science. And then you put the, um, the dollies in the middle. And uh, I had Lucy, my wife, uh, doing the tread because, uh, well, I'm just not good at that. I have too fat of uh, fingers to do that. She did uh, the tread connecting them, but you put them in the middle and then you connect them over, the, over all the... Oh, one went off. I guess that happens. I just made it, so I still, uh, still have to put some weight on. And of course, there have to be uh, carriages on, on uh, well, this is about 45 degrees to get them straight. And then here will come a station. This is connected to the big station. And then on top there will be a station just to simulate it and to hide the, the mechanics. I don't know what's wrong with that truck. goes a little bit crooked. Might be the wheel or the cable. I'll, I'll see. I'll fix it. Anyways, I thought I shared that with you guys. And uh, thank you for watching my video. And see you in the follow-up of this funicular railroad. See you the next time. Bye-bye.